I am alive, and it's good to be alive. Coming at you with a smooth sound today. Just kidding. Today I'm checking out the Ferox, everybody, and this one hits so fucking hard. Oh, it's so good. I love it. I love a good crit weapon. So this thing is pretty much a mini Opticor. Well, I wouldn't say mini. There's nothing mini about it. If you catch my drift, it's a pretty big stick. Um, this thing basically charges like the Opticore, but has a much smaller charge time, but also a smaller laser. It's a little bit of a pew, 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 pew. Here, I'll just show you guys what I'm talking about. So basically, when you shoot it, it's got a little charge time on it, and then it fires instantly upon the charge time finishing. Uh, this weapon has a really nice crit damage multiplier and a very high base critical chance, so... Honestly, building this weapon for crit, you'd be stupid not to do that. It also does primarily puncture damage, so it's really good against the Grenier. So I've spawned in some level, I think, 60 enemies? 50. 50 enemies. Just to kind of kind of give you a basic example of how it works here. So this weapon, honestly, is very good. And it's really cool because when you kill people, it looks like a charged melee attack. So it kind of, like, disintegrates them. And it's freaking awesome. My only complaint with it is you can't hold the charge like you can a bow. So sometimes my aim with this thing, and this is honestly just comes down to me personally. I sometimes am a freaking idiot and can't manage to hit anything. So like that! Oh, God! I suck so good! But if you can manage to stun enemies and shoot them in their assholes like that, it's pretty effective. And also, what makes the Ferox pretty damn cool is it has a throwing alternate fire button, just like the Javelock, only this one has some nice crowd control. It zaps enemies and pulls them in, kind of like a vortex, and it also procs abilities onto them. My god, what have I done? I've fallen! So as you can see here, these guys are trapped, and it's pretty cool. It's honestly pretty crap for damage, I've noticed. Like, if, if you're honestly doing any activity worthwhile, uh, like a sortie or anything, it's gonna be pretty much garbage you're gonna use it only for the cc but it is really fun to pair with other weapons like for example when i'm doing a defense or a mobile defense mission sometimes let's say this is a hallway i'll throw this here and then i'll pull out my Zenastar and throw it this way like the oh my god i'm sorry and as you can see there you've pretty much got this hallway locked down with damage and then this hallway's being cc'd with your ferox and then use your secondary to light them up so it's a fun weapon i honestly I have nothing bad to say about it. Uh, I kind of suck with aiming it because you can't hold the charge fire, but that's honestly just me. It is a cool weapon, and it's a great idea. It's nice to finally have a staff gun, a uh, spear gun, excuse me, that is finally on par with sort of some higher-end players. No offense to the Javlock, but I don't care much for it. So, Ferox is really cool. You guys should definitely pick it up. If you want to build this weapon, it's not too terrible either. You research it in the clan dojo in the Corpus Research Center, and basically to actually build the weapon once you get its blueprint, you're just gonna need five field run. It's not that bad, so you can either build the field run with blueprints, or you can just do invasions to get it as rewards. I hope this video was helpful. If there's anything else you want to know, drop a comment down below. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace!